there's a couple of things that I like to think about when it comes to grace. And the first one we talk a lot about, I think I kind of what was a buzzword in 2020 was the idea of empathy. And empathy mm -hmm. is that ability to feel someone else, uh, feel the discomfort, the pain of others. And that's a good thing. You know, it's not sympathizing in a sense that says, oh, I understand. It's, it's oh, I know what you're going through, but it's this, this feeling it. But from a leadership standpoint, what, what um, empathy must become something more. And I like to think of that the expression of empathy is compassion. Okay, mm -hmm. so acting on compassion, and so how do how do we act with compassion? And I have some notes here, so uh, my memory is shot. So I always have to refer to notes <laughs> when I am. So I turn compassion into um, an acronym, and and it's things that are just kind of you don't have to know all of this, but it's just this: uh, communicate, operate, uh, meet people where they are, put others first, stay back, initiate, and you need help ask for it. But the idea, it, what I'm trying to do is uh, think about compassion is not just say act with compassion, Where go where you are needed. As I said this before, is don't wait to be asked. How can you show? So let's take it for the workplace. Someone is, you know, if you're in some, one of your employees is going through a, a challenging time, make it known that you are available or resources are available. Don't impose, but say, hey, we're there for you. Do you need some time off? Do you, <clears throat> how can we do this? Do I, do you need extra services? Do you want to do employee assistance program? But be proactive. Don't wait for the problem. Put yourself out there. I'm there for you. And also make it known that, you know, you're not alone. And we're, we had, we saw this a great deal um, in, w in during the long uh, uh, Iraq War when there, a lot of our vets were suffering uh, post traumatic syndrome, mm. and what happened was senior officers were coming forward and saying, "Hey, I have it too." Okay, and when they then gave their uh, by a senior officer admitting to the challenges that he or she were facing, it gave permission for others, other vets, most of whom have had left the service by that time to seek help. Um, mm -hmm. and so making it safe for them, that's an act of grace. So that's what I'm, that's how to act with, that's leading with compassion, uh, going out there, revealing something of yourself when appropriate, um, making it known that you're there to be, um, to help other people. Um, and, uh, it, it's just, uh, that kind of connection that we see, and we all look for, it. you know, we're human beings. Um, so we, we want that personal um, that others are interested in us.